Of all the requests I've gotten for gameplay or anything else for Paralives, it's been about new Parafolk life stages, and today we now have a public preview of the babies and toddlers coming to Paralives. So apologies if my voice is a little bit off, I am currently either suffering from allergies or sickness or probably both, but let's get into this now public Patreon post. And keep in mind, this actually was back in November 2022 and is just now public for non-Patreon members, so they are into other things that they are working on now with live mode as well. However, this post concerns the visuals of babies and toddlers. Details regarding the plans for gameplay related to them are going to be coming at a later time. We then get a look at a toddler beside a crib, and I will note that I think that they really add some whimsical details, especially with that rug, and I think that the onesie is also very cute. I will say I've heard some criticism of Parafolk in general, and that is about the skin overlay details, and I actually am going to agree here. While I think the features are relatively cute, and I think it's relatively pretty well done. I will say that the blush kind of look to them, some people have described it as sun-kissed or even sunburnt, where there's kind of more of a pinkish reddish tint. I definitely think that could be adjusted or maybe tuned down a little bit or allow people to adjust it themselves because I definitely see where people think that is a little bit overdone. Now we actually get to see some crawling animation and I think this is really good to see just an idea of what the animations are going to look like. And of course, again, keep in mind Mind, this is in the early stages. And while it could be slightly smoother, I personally think it's looking pretty good, at least for the initial stages. To see a baby rolling around in their crib, and once again, a look at kind of what the textures look like. I'm going to emphasize again that I think that some of these details are really cute. I like the little wrinkles, and I do really actually like the eyelashes as well. However, I will still say that I think the skin overtone overlay in terms of looking a little bit pinkish or reddish could be tuned down just a bit. We then get a closer look at the toddler. We look at the pigtail style. I'm definitely interested to see the different styles that are going to come for these life stages. Of course, more can be added, and I always say less is more because there is going to be a lot of customization. It's also worth noting that there are two different textures. One is for the baby and one is for the toddler. The two will share a lot of clothing with each other, which is handy. More hairstyles, clothing, and facial presets will be available in the future, so you'll be able to fully customize your babies and toddlers. So overall, I definitely like that they are giving us previews of their development, and even though this is just now public, I think it's good to see what's going on behind the scenes. Like I said, when people say that Paralive's development is slow, they don't realize that a lot of things aren't revealed until later, which are revealed a lot sooner to Patreon members. My final feedback is that I do think that the skin overlay is just a little bit reddish or pinkish, but that could be adjusted. And beyond that, I am just really excited to see more life stages and, of course, very eager to learn more about the gameplay. Let me know what you think about this in the comments below. Take care, and I will see you in the next one.